Hey, how's it going everyone? This is Pullman Style and for this video, I decided to style my outfit with Air Jordan 2 Retro Q54. As usual, my videos focus on styling Air Jordan sneakers with everyday outfit that is appropriate for all ages. The clothes that I feature may range from high fashion brands to street brands, but sometimes I like to style with other well-known brands that are more accessible to the mass public like you'll see in this particular video. Without further ado, here is the close-up 360 view of the sneakers. This is Air Jordan 2 Retro Q54, which dropped in summer of 2016. For those of you who are not aware, Q54 is an annual street basketball tournament in Paris that Jordan Brand started to sponsor since 2006. I'm not exactly sure when the very first Jordan Q54 sneakers collaboration released, but there have been several iterations over the years. For example, we got another Jordan Q54 collaboration this year with Air Jordan 5 Silhouette, and I'm still interested in grabbing a pair in the secondary market. Usually, Jordan Q54 sneakers sell out and they are difficult to cop for retail outside of EU zone. As such, after eyeing for a month, I had to pay resale for Air Jordan 2 Q54 in 2017 when I finally decided to pull the trigger. Jordan Q54 collaboration sneakers tend to use higher quality materials and this is not an exception for this particular release. I love the thick cut leathers in bone colorway with gold accents. Oftentimes, when Jordan brand incorporates metallic gold accents, they tend to look very cheap but that is not the case here thanks to the smart use of combination of real metallic and plastic gold pieces instead of just plastic ones. Also, in addition to the premium leathers, I love how different leather panels play around with various textures. For example, the mudguard around the toe area has super nice grainy leather, while the leathers on toe box and ankle areas have vintage crackle leather-like texture. Additionally, the side leather panels are done in clean, smooth leather. Finally, I like how the white midsole give break between predominantly bone white leather upper and the milky translucent outsole. All the gold accents go really well with the bone white colorway of the sneakers and Q54 logo as well as other branding details add extra touch to make this masterpiece a must-have collection for hardcore Air Jordan fans. What I really like about Air Jordan 2 Q54 is that it successfully captures what Air Jordan 2 originally intended to achieve in the 80s when Nike first released this particular Jordan model. Nike wanted Air Jordan 2 to be luxury performance sneakers that can be worn both on and off the court. In other words, Air Jordan 2 aimed to be the very first designer sneakers. Nike went as far as manufacturing the original Air Jordan 2s from Italy instead of the Nike factories in Taiwan and Korea. This concept of wearing performance basketball sneakers off-court for luxury lifestyle use was way ahead of its time. Although I only have two colorways of Air Jordan 2s in my collection, I actually love this silhouette. I wish Jordan brand released more Air Jordan 2s but at the same time when they do, they tend to release in weird colorways or materials. With the Rise and Designer sneakers, I wish Jordan brand revisits the original concept of Air Jordan 2 and release premium versions. In my mind, this Air Jordan 2 Q54 is executed perfectly because it successfully captures the luxurious image of the original intention of the sneakers. Colorway, leather, gold accent, milky also, and Q54 branding all come together to separate this pair from other regular Jordan releases and make it an instant classic that turns head. Once again, for those of you who are more interested in the in-depth written review of the sneakers, you can find them on my Instagram. All you have to do is search hashtag Air Jordan Review. After that, there should be all the feeds with written reviews of my Air Jordans that I have posted in the past. Among them, you should identify three postings with Air Jordan 2 Q54 pictures and click each of them for the in-depth written reviews. 
The review is divided into three parts via three postings with breakdown points given to the sneakers. Overall value or the overall score I have given is 46 out of 50, which represents 92 percentile. So if you're looking for a pair of Air Jordan 2 that truly captures the original concept of the sneakers, you don't need to look further. This is one of the best non-OG colorways that has released from Jordan brand in my opinion. For the outfit with the sneakers, I decided to dress down while matching the overall colorway of the sneakers. I matched a simple lounge style Ashta long sleeve t-shirt in desert sand sun wash colorway with super comfortable vapor colorway Viha pants. Both the top and the bottom are from Lululemon Lab, which focuses on lifestyle clothing for the brand. I really like what Lululemon has been doing with their men's line lately and Lululemon Lab does an excellent job of bringing lifestyle clothing that works perfectly well with my Jordans. Both the top and the bottom are extremely breathable. Although the Viha pants are made out of water repellent fabric, extra ventilation near the inner thigh parts keep these pants comfortable yet functional. This is another aspect of Lululemon clothing that I really appreciate. As much as the brand focuses on the design and the looks of its products, it never forgets the root of performance athletic wear. Drawstrings around the leg openings to convert the pants into joggers, zippers around the pockets to secure belongings, and built-in belt around the waist for easy adjustments are all nice design details that enhance the looks as well as the functionality of the pants. Similarly, the top is also extremely comfortable and functional. Yes, the loose fit style of the shirt makes it easy to move around in. However, what makes Ashta long sleeve t-shirt special is that the material is very thin, breathable, and stretchy while maintaining the original shape of the shirt even after several washes. In addition to the good looks, the shirt is extremely versatile and I can even wear the shirt to hit the gym if necessary. All in all, light beige like color of the shirt is an ideal match with off-white colorway of my Air Jordan 2 Q54 while the lighter color of the pants give good separation between the two. To give you guys a better look, I once again wore my outfit outside to show what it looks like in a daylight and how the Air Jordan 2 Q54 come together with the rest of the overall style. This is a super casual outfit that most guys should be able to pull off. Loose fit long sleeve t-shirt with casual pants make this perfect for weekend outings or any occasions that may require high mobility. Overall style and color of the outfit is very simple. As mentioned, Air Jordan 2 Q54 perfectly captures Air Jordan 2's original concept, which is luxury performance basketball sneakers. By pairing simple yet casual style clothing with sophisticated yet luxurious designer-like sneakers, balance is achieved to give elegant overall looks that work for all ages. Younger guys can still add level of maturity and sophistication with an outfit like this, while the older guys can maintain clean and modern style while looking younger. What do you guys think of the overall style? More specifically, what do you guys think of the Air Jordan 2 Q54 on feet? As much as I love my Air Jordans, what is more important is how I can coordinate an everyday outfit that is not only functional but also actually looks great with the Jordans. Furthermore, I find it quite challenging to style Jordans with everyday clothing style that works for all ages. That is especially true when I'm trying to dress up or dress down as I have here. My videos will always aim to address those challenges, so please do tune in regularly if you like the content. For those of you who made it all the way to the end, I really appreciate your support and please like or comment any suggestions that you may have. Also, please don't forget to subscribe on my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram at ProManStyle. Thanks for watching and see you next time.